Hello everyone, I'm Mr. McClover, and thank you for joining me here in Hoi for Old World Blues, resuming in our campaign as New Vegas. So we got pretty thick last time, we took out California, we took out the 80s, and now we might end up in a war against the Grand Tribes, which we will, as well as end up in a war against a Vault City as well. So we, ooh, there goes Kaiser. we have all small arms, a couple things to talk about, comments, first of all. Well, let's do this one first. Rapid Response Network. So, if the Mojave and New Vegas are to survive, we shall need to be able to defend any corner of it at a moment's notice. This means investing in our crumbling infrastructure. So, uh, actually, wow. Oh, over 111 places to get infrastructure. So, one comment from yesterday said, I should use Collins commands to get the fourth family to get that research slot. Well, we have to take the focus to assassinate Mr. House. Technically, we already have done the coup d'etat, technically, in-game. Um, but we also be in a faction with the Mojave chapter. I'm not going to do it just because I've already used Collins commands once. Because we already have, I had used cons commands to get security on Mark II's. Yes, this is, makes more sense for me to actually use cons commands in a situation like this. But it is what it is, you know. Uh, all it does for that other focus, it gives us another research slot. So we already have five. I'm going to get a sixth one. That would make it seven. We're, all, we're, we're already pretty strong, let's be real. We don't really need to go down that way. We get some more war support. I mean, I'd like to, but maybe in the next campaign we're going to play as New Vegas, I'll choose the fourth family. That's probably a good idea to actually do it like that, but in this campaign, let's leave it at rest. For now. For now, at least. Cool. Um, next up, another comment was whether I should use ballistic weaponry or uh, energy weaponry. Sometimes my brain just, just, just does not compute things very well. Uh, so... I like the, I would say arguments, but the points that each side brings up. Uh-oh, that's not good. But I was convinced by one side that said, role-playing-wise, we already have the Omertas, we have the Kings, and they both use ballistic weaponry. We are supported by them, we supported them, so it makes sense that we should probably stick with ballistic weaponry. Apparently, I usually choose ballistic weaponry over everything else, um, so... In the next campaign, I'll use energy weapons, but for this campaign, we're going to stick with ballistic weaponry. Okay, so just for this campaign, the next campaign, we will use energy weapons. Energy weapons will be for the next campaign, and uh, can they pierce us? Yes, they can. They don't have air support, which is good, but they can pierce us, so it's good to keep an eye on that. Get to war with these guys. Now, <clears throat> I'll be realistic with you guys. We can breach the facility, but let me just say that I'm not going to do that. I've re this is my third attempt at recording this video, and every time I've clicked on breach the facility we get a certain little event wink wink nudge nudge saying that it might have been a trap to breach the facility the facility might exist to keep things in rather than to keep us out let's just put it like that so we'll do this fo this not a focus but this decision a little later on when we are <clears throat> more than ready just because i want to go to war with the nevada pack with vault city new reno but i also want to be ready at any time to go to war with Kaisar's Legion. You never know what they're going to do. But let's grab another research slot. So, war never changes, but the weapons we use in it most certainly do. If we're going to fight our foes, we need to evolve just as the Wasteland has. Absolutely. Cool. And you guys, I love my robots. Love them, love them, love them. Now, I don't think we have enough robots here to really push in effectively, so we're going to wait just a little bit. The others, we have seven, they have nine divisions. That's quite a bit of a difference. We think... Let's get some more logistic companies, that'd be nice. Could we actually win here? Maybe, yeah, maybe, yeah, okay. If we can win here, we can beat everyone else along the way, so. Just go right on ahead. Losses well, 3 versus 149, now it's going to increase to... Well, they're not done yet, so. But we're winning pretty darn nicely. Yep, beat up some more divisions. 81, 82, 83, 3. Pulse code modifications, cool. 333 versus 220. Very good. Nice. We're doing pretty darn well down here. Was that really surprised? And we do get to eventually annex these guys down here, too. That'd be nice. I don't think it was for that. This is going to be probably a full wasteland conquest, to be honest with you. We're going to use a lot of robots. A ton of robots. What are we building? Uh, we could build some more of this, maybe, and then build one more of this. Keep working on infrastructure. Infrastructure is crucial to our war efforts. Monoplane detectors, please. Thank you. And I do have a cup, a half cup of vanilla decaf coffee. Good stuff. Glorious stuff. Some of the best stuff. And we should be almost done. And can you guys put here? That'd be nice. Yeah, looks like so. 
Nice. Now, this was one of the blueprints you could get if you went down with the fourth family in the focus tree, but that's okay. And I do want to core Shady Sands next, so I'm going to save up my political power to be able to get 300, so we get a nice big old chunk of manpower. Side general tech, very good. Let's just use that next, thank you. Hmm. Cypher for Yinta is fully scripted. Minor radiation leak is done. Y legs are done. Kaiser's Legion is next. Bomb, bomb. We don't need to do that stuff. We don't need that one either. Bomb, bomb. I really don't care, as you can tell. Too much? Not really. Sure, we'll do that one next. Look at all this. That looks really nice. Look at the resources. They're so good. So good. War ah, war labs, just like the simulations. Well, we're, I think we're done with the land auction, aren't we? I already finished the land auction. I have. Good. Um, sure. We can grab... Yeah, you know what? We can, we can get some dynamite. We haven't done that one yet. Oh, and next up we shall do... How do we get security? Let's do Securitron Deployment Line. So the BDQ, PDQ-88B Securitron produced by House Industries supports only two operating systems, Mark 1 and Mark 2. The Mark 1 operating system lacks drivers for the auto repair systems and explosives weapons, limiting the robot's arsenal to, the, to be built in X-25 Gatling Laser and M99... Oh, M99... M99... 9MM machine gun. Securitron... It's easier to build. I cannot speak. My apologies. Woo, words are difficult to say. Woo. Go ahead, guys. Keep going. Keep going. Cool. And someday we will have uh, the justification done for Vegas. There they go. Mm, if anything, I probably want to buddy up everyone right here. And we should have it done actually very, very soon. Uh, that's a little bit ahead of time. Nice. Logistics 2. How about we get Logistics 3? Uh, looking pretty good. We need some more war support, some more stuff like that. Uh, let's get some of this. Breach the facility. We'll do that later. Provide power armor to scavengers. And eh, we could try that. Preemptive strike or interception. Uh, we could probably do that too. I know I have stuff I could research instead, but that's okay. First, let them spread out here first. That's fine. Let's just go ahead and go to war. Get this over with. Now, they're attacking us. Over here, let them spread out a little bit. Even though we have a lot of compliance already here. Already, that's fine. Whatever. Um, how much infantry armor? Oh, we got plenty. I did switch a lot of these stuff around um, off screen, so. 1.2,000. We probably have enough for this as well. Probably not for this as well. We need some more doggos. Um, we already have doggos on them. Nice. Good stuff, my friends. Good stuff. How much infantry armor do we have? 800 some. Is that enough? Let's see. Close that. That's good. That's good. Should be enough for everyone. Yeah. Nice. That's good stuff, man. <laughs> Actually, could you just come through this part? That's not bad. It's not much, but, you know, it's okay. They're not attacking here at all. A little surprising, but that's okay. We come right on in and have a good time. Cool, I love it. Our plane bombers, no extra planes. They're probably going to shut down. The defenses are online. Great. Let's restore Dugway Proving Grounds. Nice. Oh, we're not exactly winning here. Send one guy help out. Okay, well, that's nice. Hey, look at that. An encirclement. The first of many. And they go bye-bye. Pop. Pop. And a little bit of a pop. Cool. At this point... Good. And what we're going to do is go like here. And I want to push right there. Cut all these guys off if we can. I usually don't like doing big encirclements because smaller encirclements are just easier to do. 
Oh, we actually might be able to push here too. What are the losses? 223 versus 4,000? That ain't bad. Let's get everyone up on the line. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, wow, that's a lot of manpower. Jesus. Cool. You know what? We could use even more manpower. Oh, we can't core that yet because we probably don't have this. Death Valley. Nice. Huh? Got Death Valley first. 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 Government Cypher Schools. Very good. And let us do this. Uh, it's really hard to see that. Just make your way up there. Oh, I'll have everyone else attack. Let everyone else attack. Keep everyone else in place first. So that's so that we can make this encirclement complete. Warrior equipment, very good. Uh, we can grab that one next. Cool. Secure drone deployment line. Let's grab that one. So, the construction of the PDQ-88 Secure Drone is a priority for the people of New Vegas, as this reliable and steadfast medium robot has been a symbol of the city's defensive capabilities for decades. Expanding deployment is a cheap, but it's utterly worthwhile. Very good. Oh yeah, we're expanding. Yeah. Very good, yeah. Just keep working on it, guys. Go up that way. Cut them all off. We don't even want Vault City yet. We just want to cut off their supply. Losses. A well, couple of losses versus 9,000. Oh, we got to cut off ourselves. That's not good. Uh, take half of you guys. Come down there. Back. That'd be good. Yeah. I'll try to free those guys. That'd be good. Come on. Move. Good. Come that way as well. Out of Confederation. Good. Get the supplies in there. Come on. Kill them off. Kill them off. They're just humans. We got supplies. We got supplies. Now they should be able to get up there. They follow up They can't stand up much more. Great. Now terminate with, terminate with extreme prejudice, my friends. Uh, they lost 16,000. I've lost 300. New, re, oh, come on. I want more casualties. Ooh, dynamite. I like that. Mm. Get some maintenance companies. Come on. We need MODOK. Oh, you guys need orders. That's fine. Just come down here then. It's fine. Whatever. Machine assisted encryption. Good. Losses are 20,000. Not bad. Cool. And they're done. A lot easier than I thought. Because if you let New Reno stay there, they get pretty strong over time. So, Cool. Unfortunately, though, I will be right back. All right, my friends, sorry about that. Uh, I had to attend to other things. Regardless, though, we have just taken out the Nevada Pact. So, we could have a little interesting time. We could take out the Brotherhood right now. Or, we could take out the Legion. Now, we can go to war with either one at any time. Now, I'm thinking, though. Actually, White Legs and New Canaan are killing each other off, which is really nice. Hmm. What does the Troll War have to do next? They're doing the Great Horde. We might consider the Bone Snarl War Cry going to war with the Brotherhood next. First Ambitions. Uh, the Southern Push. What does this do? For Arroyo. Hmm. Arroyo Klamath. Which we don't own Klamath, but the Brotherhood does. Ah, uh, you know what? We might just go ahead and go war with the, the Legion first. Just because we get rid of them. We can do no gods, no masters. That is probably what we want to do here. So, time for a little Legion War. Actually, can we bust through the damn busters? Please let me... No! No! Actually, we can go to war with them. They're enslaving colonists. I do want to see what they're going to be up to with this, though. Can they still do Conquering the 86, Crossing the Rubicon, Hoover Dam, War for Hoover Dam. Owner is a member of the NCR. Ah. First battle for Hoover... Mm hmm. Hmm. Things might be a little glitched. Because Kaisar can't go to war for Hoover Dam now. <sighs> That's a case. Then we'll go to war with the Brotherhood. An executive decision. It's, this is actually not going to be easy. Uh, yeah. Yeah. We'll do it like this. Main group. Focus this area. That's where we're going to concentrate most of our forces. You guys, come down here. But really... Actually, you guys. Uh, actually, you know what? I'll, I'll leave all you guys right here. 
because you guys are gonna do one, two, three. You'll stop any river crossings coming over. Probably they will try to navally invade us. Now, this is a case. We take out the Brotherhood. That means we need to be prepared for a potential war with the Troll War. Because Troll War want or have claims on Klamath and Arroyo, which the Brotherhood owns, which is really not good for us. Which is fine. Whatever. It's a challenge. And I'll gladly accept the challenge. Just let the time go on unless something happens between now and. And a potential war against me and Kaisar. Hopefully it doesn't happen. Hope it doesn't happen. But we'll see what happens. I have no idea. Oh, we got enough support robots. Let's switch everyone over. Ooh, power armor. Yes! We can make power armor, my friends. Finally, we can make some power armor. I love power armor so much. Probably too much. Oh, we're going to need... Mm, we're going to need more stuff here. Yeah, we can't afford that yet. That's okay. That's okay. Everyone else? It's time to get a little thicker. We need some more support robots, that's fine. Oh, we definitely need to do that, thank you. Three to five, do that. There you go. Uh, anything over here? Dynamite, yes. Strip power armor, yes. Make one for now. Make one for now. Ships, I'm just gonna wait till we get the best ships, because there's no point to get those ships at all. Not at all, good. Keep building, keep building. Power armor scavengers attacked. I don't know how, but our scavengers were attacked. Abandoned ra raiders in power armor. A lot of coordinated strike upon our scavengers and created an epic battle that left dozens dead. The ensuing battle rocked out near a nearby village, and many of the raiders died, but we had to retreat. Well, that is not bueno. Ah. Actually, how is a brother doing? They don't think have an extreme amount of divisions around here, which is fine. Surge research. 14,000 manpower is quite a bit. 58 divisions. Brotherhood knights. Those are looking pretty weak. Power armor's looking pretty strong. Not, you know, too strong, but, you know, pretty strong. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Machine assisted. Good. Good. Very good. Uh, grab some planes right there. We're going to need some air bases up here. Up there. And throw one in the middle. Expand deployment. Good. Next up. We shall do... Oh, actually, I, I, I kind of like this one. Get some workshops. Critical population factor. Motorized, infantry, bombers, combat robots, combat robots. Let's go with H&H &H Tools Grand Reopening. H&H &H Tools Factory is the House's family-owned company. Robert House, his half-brother, Anthony House, cheated the inheritance of the company from Mr. House when their father died. Anthony House suffered from paranoia, which led to increasingly severe security measures at the company between 2020 and 2023. Oh, it's taken this long to get the doors open again. God dang, wow. Uh, civilian factory and faster combat robot production. Great. We're doing extremely well on anti tank, though. Uh, hopefully, we don't need that anymore. We don't need that anymore. Cool. And Riders looking pretty awesome. Specialized Warfare is pretty awesome as well. If we're going to use. Oh, man, we don't even have. 18 combat width. What have I been doing? <clears throat> wow, that's not bueno. Alright, so are, are our guys on the line? You guys are, yes. You guys are over there, and yes. You guys are down here, and you're going to get smacked down probably fairly hard down there. Uh, do we have any extra planes? No. Kind of sucko, but whatever. Um, everyone has some sort of planage, which is fine. Monoplane attackers. I should probably actually work on planes a little bit more, to be honest with you. Help cover them. Any more divisions? Nice. No, wrong one. There you go. Common weaponry. Good. We can get that. We can do that. But we're going to go ahead and do not that yet. Because we have no divisions down there to really use them. Yeah, we'll get that some of that. That's good stuff. That's, that's some real good stuff. Basic weaponry. Very good. Well, there's no point in just wasting time talking about it. Let's go ahead and go to war. Let's see what happens. Oh, they attack us here. That's not good. That's one division holding out. No wonder... Uh, watch out for spies. They're attacking us over the waterways. They're attacking us over here. Stuff I already knew that would happen. If you guys can push really hard, that would be great. Oh, yeah, they're doing really well. Uh, a lot of the infantry cannot pierce us because they're just apparently 10 combat width with nothing else on them. Uh, power armor? We can't pierce each other. That's okay with me. Now we have enough army XP to actually increase the Gamora Thug size. We can throw on some demo companies. Um, between this and them, 3, 3, 10. 
16 for 9. Yeah, I, honestly, there's there's no... Yeah, you could throw on demo companies. Demo companies, but even infantry gives you right now more breakthrough. And more HP, more organization, same recovery rate. I mean... You might as well just go with infantry, man. Anything over here? Throw on the demo teams eventually, of course. Uh, that should help out. Maintenance companies would be nice. Probably not necessary, though. Uh, I think I usually choose... I don't know which one I usually choose. I think the last time I chose a grenade rifle, I'm going to go with flamers this time. Oh, that's not good. That's getting better. Getting better. Even more robots. Throw them on, boys. Throw them on. Change to Del Sol. Very good. Very good. Hey! Power armor is gone. Okay, Courier 6, you are our leader, and you're also leading a group of robots in the field. Good luck. Fortunate leader. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. This is Carter. Whoops. I chose the wrong one. I thought we were doing the Courier. Oh, well. You can't take it back any anyways. Whatever. I want you to go there. Just come up there. Cut anyone else off here. You. Do the same thing just in case. Oh, we must have lost our ship. No! We lost Loka Nuho. Well. Oh, well. All that naval XP now no longer here. That's okay, whatever. I, I didn't really care about it too much anyways. Alright, next up. Breach of facility where you're not doing that one. Provide power armor to scavengers. We can do that one. Focus on the internal sphere. We can wait. Military society. Nah, that's not. That's all worthless. For now. Uh, light canoes. I mean, no, no, I'm not going to waste time doing garbage stuff like that. Motorized APCs. Uh, you know what? Let's not go APCs this game. We're not going to go APCs, but we're going to go with tanks. That sounds like fun. Sure, why not? Watch out for spies. Good. I mean, we'll use APCs in our tank divisions. But I'm not just going to make any pure APCs. Nice. How oh, good are we doing? The Brotherhood is actually pretty easy so far. Uh, let's see. You, me, and 71 losses versus 6,000. That's not bad. That's actually a little better for the Brotherhood than I thought what would happen so far. That's alright, though. Go up. Rapid prototyping. Don't want to forget that side of the focus tree. H and H grand retool opening. And Zaps Neon Signs. Once a major sign manufacturing company, Zaps Neon Signs once even lit up the Las Vegas trip itself. Now they're even more known for being used as an impassable perimeter walls. A whole two civilian workshops. How glorious. New Canaan and Cos. Oh, we're New Canaan, huh? If you really want to cut them off, just go that way. Supplies becoming an issue around here, which is not good. Have they pushed it around anywhere? No, that's decent. All right, let's take a look at what we know about them so far. Thirty. Well, they definitely lost quite a few divisions. They've, ten, they've lost at least four thousand manpower, if not training more guys. Hey, I'm not going to use you guys yet, but that's okay. You guys are completely cut off and put them out of misery. Beautiful. Good. Now I guess we can head on down there and have a good time. So this part of California will be conquered. I'm glad we already raised our conscription level, just because now we can actually use it to make sure we have enough resistance suppression around here, which we have to. We might need to increase the amount of fire teams we have. Advanced circuitry. Thank you. Crowd control, raise it up by five. Uh, is there anything else we can do about that? Not really. You can do that first, I suppose. Dogs are doing pretty well. Army Depot. Steal some tech, even though I never do it. I do it just to say we can do it. Uh, you know what? I want tanks. We gotta, we gotta spend some time, serious time with uh, vehicles. But we have six research slots, so it doesn't really matter too much. They're not taking anywhere else. Just shredding through them. Shredding them. I love caps. Love, 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 love caps. Well, I love caps when we have enough of them. Hopefully, we don't find the enemy navy again. Turner. Capture former. Defenses are online. Great. I guess split off if you need to, which. Honestly, I don't think you'll probably need to split off, but we'll see what happens. And we need to keep an eye on these guys, because they're doing assimilate the people, which is nice, but. If they can't do uh, War for Hoover Dam, I might just give it to them. Hoover Dam 1, I'm going to control. Rock, well, rocket launchers would be nice by this point. And I immediately lost it. Okay, no more no more training while we're just hanging, hanging out. Battle steamers. Dynamite. Very cool. Uh, more naval stuff, I guess. If we really need to sails, sure, why not? 
make the biggest navy for not too much. Okay, let's store Beale Air Force Base. Hold two air bases and some more stuff. Merchant spies? Sure, I'd love merchant spies. You can probably just push in randomly now. Alright, come down here. Actually, we should probably just take out the she. Ah, oh, that's 45 dead. That's not bad. Zaps neon signs. Next up, we shall do rebuild Vegas sewage system. Sewage is one of the lost commodities of the old world that only a handful of places can truly understand or appreciate. But soon enough, everyone in New Vegas will know the joy that can be brought by such facilities. Ah, critical population factor goes up. Great. They're not attacking me. Why? Can I win here immediately? Doesn't look like it. So don't worry about it. All right, we got time. We got time. You know what, everyone? Hold and then reevaluate your, yourselves and your lives. They return empty-handed. Well, at least they returned. Go ahead and move in if you can. Let's see if we can do it again. Eh, well, eventually. We're doing more resources. Just we don't need any more water, which is good. Let's finish this off, and then we'll split these two into two armies like normal. Metal bows, rubber barges, always good to get. Come on, guys, keep moving in. You're taking forever again. Seriously, like, just move in. Oh. God dang it. I. I got... What? What? Don't garrison an area, you dingus. No, no. Stop it. Do your job. Oh my goodness. Well, screw it. We'll do it like this then. Pop, 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 pop. There you go. Over here, you're just gonna come. Eh, you, actually, you can just stay right there for now. You can try to fight these guys off. And then once that other air, army is taking over other areas. Oh, they're still attacking us. Nice. Good, good, good. Once this is done, then we're gonna move our guys over here. Probably try to breach over the little river. Any more guys? Nope. That's fine with me. We have quite a deficit of. Wow, we have a massive deficit of these guys. We need some more resources, which means we need to buy some more. But also build up more roads so that we can get more resources. Um, we can go to war with those guys, which is kind of nice. These guys can do that first. Do that as well. We don't have a lot of advanced components or stuff like that. Ranger Citadel, we'll do it right there. I mean, just eventually. Yes, I know it's a waste of time building up infrastructure in places you can't even get to. I, I'm just so used to building it everywhere, so. And also keep building up factories. Good. And we're gonna war the she. Are we ready? Yeah, pretty much. You must go ahead and take him out. Hey, rapid prototyping, good. Oh, we get the next one immediately. Whoops, I've really neglected that side of the tree. Good job, guys. Now, with that in mind, you guys are going down going to be there. You guys, this is just infantry. You guys should be able to push pretty easily down there. Just hanging out together with robots. Yeah, we can pierce each other, and but we're defending over a river, so that honestly should be pretty good for us. Yeah, pretty good, pretty good, pretty nice. Uh, power armor to scavengers, sure. Next up, Shady Sands. Welcome to Vegas. Very nice. And we can probably build some more roads. Quick. That's right. Vegas is going to expand across the entire wasteland bringing infrastructure to the Wastelanders, even if they don't deserve it. And if they don't deserve it, well, we'll probably colonize them even harder. Cool. Enough of that for now. Next up. Handy Servicemen. Mr. Handy Robots are just utility robots created by General Atomics International, with further development and redesign by Robco Industries. Although they were designed as general chore automatons, they are quite capable of defending themselves with their flamethrower and buzzsaw. Yes. We got a lot of national spirits. Father's influence, of course, sanitary. Nice. Very good. Are you guys down there? You are already down there. Taking a while. Let's get some more organization first. Maintenance efficiency might not be bad to throw on, but it does lower our armor. We should actually get more robots. What am I doing? I need more robots. Actually, no, I don't. I'm already using Securitron's Mark II, so that should actually already pretty darn good. Get some more heart attacks, soft attacks, stuff like that. Flesh is weak, but still has uses. We might not be able to break out through there. They're still attacking us over here. 
losses, 80, less than 100, god dang. The Sheev lost quite a few too. So on from the front, I'm actually going to raise war support instead of getting, instead of getting political power, because we could actually use more war support, honestly. 676, six, not bad. We're slowly winning over here, which will break us over the river, which will be great, 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 great. You guys, how's life? RK Ganon? How are you doing, son? By the We're still getting more manpower, are we? Mobilizing. God dang. Love it. You guys are doing great. Man, this is a big, big... Oh, you know what? Before we go to War of the Legion, we'll probably kill off the Troll Warren. That's probably what we're going to have to do. Oh, no. Oh, good, good. A victory for all the Vegas that we will remember. Oh, River Bodge. Very good. Let's grab some more of the speed, too. How strong is the Troll Warren? Eaters of Mankind, a victory all of Vegas will remember. They're not that strong. Around 100 divisions, 2,000 extra spare manpower, that's not much. We need more planes. Uh, you know what? I need more military factories, so... Now we'll get cracking on building some. There you go, that's gonna last quite a while. Now we've, we've gotten over, which is good. Which is very good. Yeah, they might be able to actually pierce us over there. They got a lot of divisions, but... They're not being used very well. And you guys are just kind of hanging out, having a good time. And our new power merges in Utah. There go the white legs. Having a good time. These guys are a little crazy, not gonna lie, a little crazy. They're even stopping us here too, so. 30,000 manpower. I'm glad we're getting better production costs for combat robots, but let's grab Gutsy Sergeants. Mr. Gutsy is a line of military robot models created by General Atomics International. It's a militarized version of the Type 1 Mr. Handy. Gutsy models are armed with a plasma gun, roughly equivalent to a plasma pistol, for long-range combat. At close range, the robot relies on its flamethrower. Glorious. Alright, so you must be running out of manpower by now. Yeah, 3,000. 39 divisions. They have one more than what we what they had last time when we checked. 30,000 manpower for us. We've lost over a little over 100, which is totally fine. That's why I wanted to go to War of the Sheets as well, because we wanted to break over the river, but you know what? As long as they're using up their manpower too, well, that's okay with me. Yeah, they're definitely out of manpower. Good. I love robots. Well, until they come start attacking me. Then I don't really love them. You know, if they want to keep wasting themselves on my line, so be it. So then. Dead horses, painted men. So we got. Actually. We could enter this way too, but we're a little busy over here too. Hmm. Let's let go, go on just a little bit. Let them kill, kill themselves further on our line. The She, the Brotherhood. Oh, now we've started expanding a little bit more. Nice. Our scavengers return trumpet. Great. The naval targeting system, though, isn't really helpful for us. Just saying, guys. Just saying. Do we need any more air bases around here? Maybe. That might be the push that we actually need to get through here. Good, yeah. I'm expecting a major losses by the Western Brotherhood of Steel. I mean, extreme losses. Alright, so we're done defending around here. Just go and attack when you're done. You can attack us. We're attacking you right back. And we're just hanging out over here. Carter's doing a great job. He's almost a hill spider, too. God dang, she y'all a bunch of crazies. Ah, we're spreading out. We have surrounded the hub. And the hub is ours. Good. Precision motors, very nice. Let's grab some more soft attack and heart attack. And oh, and I do plan on using assault trons for those heavy robots. Well, I maybe mean, I can't use assault trons. I'd like to, but if we already have secure trons Mark IIs, the next campaign I use robots, let me know. I will use assault trons. Let me know in the comments for the next campaign in which I use robots for the majority of my army. Just because if you're playing as Vegas, you gotta use secure trons Mark IIs. Good. Are they going to attack us? Yes, no, maybe so. Rubber refinement. No, yes. If, they, if you leave, I will attack. Um, let's do Robo Brain Strategies. Our strategists. Robo Brains are multi purpose robots. The memories and programs are stored inside an organic or partially organic brain contained in a dome shell atop their chassis. They're considered intuitively superior to most robots as human brains allow them a wider range of responses and functions. Even cheaper production costs. Yet we still have a deficit. Oh yeah, now we're struggling a little bit around here. But with these guys rolling on up, it won't be too much of an issue. Attacking over that waterway 
really would be not very good for us. Another general. BDQ BB 88B Slater. Bunker Gid. Well, that's not good. Fast Shot. Well, that's not terrible. Perceptive, Intelligent, Agile. And also... A robotics expert. Awareness. Uh, we can go sniper. Why not? We can go sniper. That's the case. I think I throw you guys on the line here. It doesn't really matter at all. Good. How many people do we get a month? 253. That's not bad. Restore Naval Air Station China Lake. Antique have engines. Get a little more hardness. Good. Now they're looking like a mess down here. Which is a tremendous thing for us. Go ahead and move into. More? Good. This will be this is all in preparation for the troll war, for the Legion. It's all for this. Dead horses, very good, very good. Beat him up, beat him up. Hey, security on AI. You got something for us? No. Expert health fighter? Yeah, I think so. Level 8, god dang, that's really strong. We have Maxin, we have Necropolis, we have the Lost Hells Bunker. I'm surprised they're still holding on. Where's their capital? Ah. Ah, San Jose. Cool. They're almost gone, though. 28,000 losses versus 227. I'll be honest, I kind of like robots. <laughs> Robots are kind of fun. Just a little fun. But these guys are next. Because I want no backstabs when I have to kill off the Legion. The Legion should be terrible to kill. What are they doing? Yeah, yeah, they, I think they're local glitched. You know, I will I will probably give them Hoover Dam for free just because I want to see if that will make them do the most of their focus tree, or the rest of their focus tree, actually. Because that will be pretty good if they can do that. Just because we already killed off the NCR with the Western Brotherhood, which they can't really do much either right now. Uh, are we lacking infantry? No, we're not. That's really good. Oh, hello. Okay, Legion is fighting these. Ejercito Mexicano, what are you doing? Holy cow. I was not expecting this. How strong are you guys? Santa Ana. Oh, that's not bad. 5,000. 75 divisions. Uh, well, my, I don't know, man. Legion might be pretty good against that. Sunjibot Enforcers. Sunjibots are military serial numbers F SB, triple, or quadruple X. Our security robots made before the Great War with the express purpose of participating in the heaviest of firefights during the war. Oh, God. It's amazing. We still have a deficit. But I love production. Love, love, love it. Good. Steam rolling them. All right, so now we've hit some. Oh, we've almost hit there. Keep these guys in place as we move down to San Francisco and San Jose. San Jose is going to fall first. Yep. There goes the Western Brotherhood. Beautiful. Finish those guys off as well. I'm going to move, march you guys up here. I'm going to march you guys up here as well. Put you over here as well. The infantry. I'm just going to leave it home, guarding against you guys. Yeah. Let me know in the comments below, should I really... Do you support my decision with giving just Boulder City to Khazar's Legion since they're stuck on uh, air production? <laughs> so, let me know in the comments below. That should be enough for that. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm not going to attack the Rapids either just because we can't afford a war with the Rapids. Oh, we, I mean, we can afford a war, but that would open up um, a lot of other waterways for Khazar to pour through, and we don't want that. We definitely don't want that. Bricks, that one next. Cool, that looks, look how great Vegas looks. We even have Baja, California. I love it. And you know what? It's time to pour some more stuff. Eh, maybe. Maybe we'll make our way up to Carson City, New Reno. That sounds like a good goal. Uh, that's not really worth it, but whatever. We'll do it anyways. Good. And if you guys need to train, yeah, you guys don't need to train. If you guys need to train, go right ahead. Give our guys just a little bit of time to get some more robots, because we are really lacking combat robots right now. Holy cow. Holy guacamole. Oh, we got processors. Uh, I'll give that one too. Why not? Dredger's good. Come up here. Hey, we still got the ship. I forgot. Third time's the charm to actually get some of these guys done. So, Broken Gust is looking pretty thick. They'll prop they might flip to Cascadia soon. Maybe, maybe not. The Brotherhood up here is doing what? 
Scribe research? Alright, they're in an alliance. Cool. You guys are doing the glorious city. They like... They love slave cities. You can tell white legs looking pretty thick. So we've got a virus. We've got some simple tracks. We're going to grab some return rollers. The Legion... I wonder how well they're doing. Yes, let's do that as well. The Legion is doing pretty darn well. They're pushing in to Santa Ana, which is generally probably a good thing. Armor hardening, very nice. I could stop time from going on, but whatever. You might actually use iBots. Maybe, maybe not. How much further... Well, we have to wait for this to go. Um, about 20 days. That's not bad, because we, we need some time to make some of this. Maybe some of this over here. Maybe we can grab a little bit of infrastructure up here, too. Because that could be pretty beneficial to uh, supply. And we have Century Bot Enforcers. Outer Vegas Security is next. So, the Force is the closest thing to a standing non-robotic army New Vegas has had. Since the families rolled into town, volunteers armed with the best the Strip can offer or provide, risking their lives to protect the interests of the city, but that's where we're going to leave today's episode, my friends. If you enjoyed today's episode, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you all tomorrow when we will take out the Troll Warren and begin probably a war with Khazar's Legion. Thanks for watching, have a great rest of your day!